have I been up to? I've been uh, fixing the house and uh, doing some renovations and I'll flip the camera around and show you. Okay guys, so it's almost winter time and I'm gonna hook up a battery maintainer. Uh, right here it is. And I'll show you how to quickly do that. This is about all the wiggle room you'll get unless you unhook these wires right here but it should be enough room to get to your battery and I'm gonna go ahead and grab it real quick and plug her up Yeah, barely has enough room to get up in there, but there's the black and then the red is on the other side. And yeah, I just leave this cover off like that. I got mouse traps, rat poison, everything to kill a rat. So I think we're good. Okay, I did a long haul with the truck and the car trailer. Uh, got a bunch of wood for renovations and uh, yeah, it didn't do too bad. It got 14 miles to the gallon uh, with these wheels and tires that I have. They're 18s and uh, the same height and dimensions as, uh, as the stock ones. Just has more tire. But, uh, figured while we was up here, I would show you this view. I'm gonna do a whole lot more views with the motorcycle. I'll pull up to these spots and show you the, the best places to see the overlooks. And uh, I got a bunch of doors and stuff on here. But yeah, this trailer weighs 2,000 pounds plus whatever that weighs. And got 14 miles to the gallon. And I'm gonna hit the road again. All right, so I went with uh, hemlock wood. Uh, this wood will actually keep the termites away and uh, it looks fantastic. Uh, this is a built on patio, so it used to be like plastic siding and uh, just replaced it with wood. And yeah, looks like a log cabin in a way. I love going to the Tennessee cabins and staying. So I was just like, let's do this to the house. and. Uh, feel like we're living in one but yeah the other part of the house is a brick so I guess you could call this a ranch house now or something similar and uh, the center blocks at the bottom I want to turn them gray right now it's got old white paint on it and I think that'll make it look better too and uh, yeah I think this is one of the best uh, renovations I've done to the house and uh, right here's the porch 
I think it's around 20 foot or so. And then um, planted a bunch of bushes uh, in the back here. I got them from the front. And then right here is the patio. And uh, it, it turned out really good too. I'll probably turn it gray too also. And um, yeah, I got this uh, dog kennel. And I'm gonna redo all of the electric fence for the dog. And I'm gonna run it a whole different route. So it'll probably be a week or so they have to stay in the kennel. But at least uh, they have both of them together. And uh, yeah. All right, here's a uh, part of the inside of the house. I was working on some new drywall. It's looking pretty good. Just got a few more pieces to put up in this room. And uh, can't wait till it's done. Okay, so here's the dining room at the moment. I got a bunch of stuff on the table, but putting the drywall in here also. I uh, had like 14 pieces of drywall. I've got like 10 more pieces to put up. And drywall takes a little while. I also redid the ceiling all the way across too. Looks way better. I'll show you the ceiling in here real quick. Uh, me and my wife did mainly all the drywall. I'm going to pay somebody to mud it, and uh, so it'll look professional. By the time it's done, you won't see any mess ups or anything. <laughs> Here's our Christmas tree. What do you think about it? Uh, we was wanting one before Thanksgiving, and then we're going to decorate it after Thanksgiving. Uh, this one, we actually found a bird's nest in it, which is kind of funny. Uh, Jessie says she threw it out. All right, I've got one more surprise to show you, and it's a bunch of these doors we put up. I think we put up eight doors. All righty, here's the doors. And uh, these doors are actually pine doors. And my papa actually came over and helped me install them all. And uh, these are actually my favorite doors. It's got all the pretty knots in it. And uh, I'll show you something cool. When I close it with these new, new doors, they uh, click. It's one of my favorite parts too. And then he also helped me with the uh, door trim. Uh, all that's new on every door. I uh, kept the front door original. I'll probably get one later with like the round glass in it. And uh, took a while to put the doors in. I'm not gonna lie because you gotta cut them, you gotta put the hinges on, you gotta make the holes for the doorknobs. It's a long process, and I uh, didn't really think about making a video of that, but if I ever do doors again, I'll, I'll hook you up. <laughs> there you are, Starlight. Can't go in there. Alrighty, let me know if you want to see any more renovation stuff. I don't know what you like, so put it in the comments. Catch you later.